Hey there everybody, it's Aubrey here. And today we're gonna look at what bats, dolphins, and the new Garmin LiDAR Light V4 LED with Quick have in common. They can all create perceptual maps of their surroundings without the human eyesight that we're accustomed to. And how do they do that? They use echolocation. Let's take the common use case of bats, for example. Most bats are nocturnal, which means that they fly and hunt for their food during nighttime when they can't use their eyes to see. So, in order to find exactly where their food is, they send out a sound into the environment and calculate how long it takes for the echo to come back to them. An insect on the wall will have a shorter distance for the sound to travel than the wall itself. That's how sensitive echolocation is. The new Garmin LiDAR Light V4 LED with Quick works practically the same way, but instead of using sound, it sends pulses of light to detect its surroundings. It sends a near-infrared light to a target and calculates the time delay between hitting that target and reflecting the light back to the sensor, all through using the speed of light. It's crazy quick, right? Which reminds me, we've added quick connectors to this board so you can start plugging and playing with it right when you get it out of the box. What do you say we see, or rather echolocate, what else is in this module? This sensor offers high accuracy and low power consumption in a tiny package. It has up to a 10 meter range, 10 centimeters resolution, and requires 85 milliamperes during data acquisition. The built-in NRF52840 microcontroller runs a pre-loaded out-of-the-box stock application to calculate the distance between itself and something in front of it. It also allows developers to create custom applications to expand on the out-of-the-box functionality or connect to an external microcontroller running a custom user application. The module doesn't require any soldering to get started. You can just read and write to the board using I2C to the addition of the quick connectors. It requires 5 volts to operate but runs on 3.3 logic. And with the 5 volt boost circuit and quick connector, the sensor can be powered and measure distance all through one piece of hardware and the quick system. Plus, the SparkFun LiDAR Lite V4 Arduino library makes getting data as easy as calling the get distance function. The newest addition to Garmin's LiDAR Lite lineup is ideal for when space is tight and power is limited. And since there's no laser on this module, you don't even need these to start working with it. Let this little module do the work of sight for you on your next project, whether that's working with a drone or a robot that needs to figure things out for themselves, like we did with the Epigon drone. Make sure to pick up yours at sparkman.com today and see all the possibilities that this module provides. And happy hacking! Hacking, 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 hacking is ideal for when power is limited and there's no, there's power limited. And since there's no laser on the board, you don't even need to use these when working with it. This is a board, and since there's no laser on this module, you don't even need these to And we make it. We make it here at SparkFun, and we make it for you. And power is limited. And since there's no little go baga booga, man, sorry Cassie, okay. For you, our customers, we do it for you.